Hi, my name is Val and I'm the product designer here at CircuitScribe. Today I'm going to talk to you about the RGB module. The RGB module is a light emitting diode module, but it lights up in the red, green, and blue colors, hence the name RGB. We're going to want to put power to our RGB module through these three feet, and each one corresponds to a different color written on the silk screen. I'm going to draw an example circuit for you guys. First, I take my stencil and figure out where the RGB fits in. Fits nicely right there. So take my conductive ink pen, draw my circles, make sure they're filled in all the way as always. There we go. Now I have a place for my RGB to sit, just like that. Remember, you don't ever want to connect the feet of the same module together, so I'm going to leave that by itself. Now I need a way to power my RGB. So I'm going to use my stencil again for my 9 volt battery adapter module. I'll put my power over here, filling the holes in all the way again. There we go. Now, like I said, the positive is going to need to be connected to these three, and the negative is going to be, have to be connected to the bottom one, the point. So first, I'll connect the negative one. There we go. Just like that. I always like to go over it twice just to make sure that I got a good connection. And now I'm going to connect just the red one for now. So when I put these modules together, I should only light up the red LED. There we go. Now, say I wanted to make a purple light. I'm going to take this guy off and connect the blue LED now to the power. So now I'll connect the modules again, and I should be lighting up the red and the blue, which will give me purple. There we go. Now I got a nice purple light. So if I connect all three at the same time, I'm, let's see what happens actually. I won't tell you yet. So we'll connect this green. Now all the colors are going to be connected. So now I'm going to connect these modules again one more time and see what color I get. There we go. All three colors gives me a white light. Now, say you didn't want to just have these lights connected. Now, I can't undo this circuit because I drew it in pen. So I'm going to draw a new circuit, which involves some sliders. Now I'll be able to adjust the colors how I want. So now I'm going to draw a circuit with three sliders, an RGB LED, and a power so that I can adjust the different colors all individually. So I need to draw pads for a power module, three different slider modules, and the LED module. Each slider module is going to correspond to a different color on the LED module. So I'll have a red slider, a green slider, and a blue slider. All right, now it's time to put my modules in place. I'm going to take my power, take my LED, my RGB LED, and then take my sliders. There, I got the blue light, I got the green light, and I got the red light. Now, all of these sliders I have set to dim, so I can individually brighten them up and decide what color I want. So, just like before, I can start with red and then say, hey, I want some purple. Slide up my blue and I got purple. I slide up my green, I got white. But now since I have the sliders in place, I can say, eh, I don't want red anymore and get a cool aqua color. or I can say, eh, I want to get rid of that blue and have a nice orange. It's pretty fun.